Here's a cool little feature in the pause menu. When you press on game info and you press up on the D-pad a couple times, you'll actually come to a menu where they give you descriptions for each boomerang you get. So, for the classic boomerang, we got the, the boomerang, carved from the wood of an ancient gum tree. This ring is light and fast. Like all boomerangs, it can be thrown in first person by pressing the Ties View button. You can also cycle through your rank collection by pressing the next rank button and previous rank buttons. So yeah, basically left and right in the D-pad. And there's also the Aquarang, found by Rex in an old shipwreck. The Aquarangs can cut through water like a hot knife through butter. Unlike the other rangs, these are the only ones that work underwater. Alrighty, so, yeah, so basically they just give you a description of each boomerang you get. Hey, yo, Paisanos! This is Toon Gamer 23 and welcome back to Let's Play Tie the Tasmanian Tiger! So in the last part, we wrapped up shipwrecks. We got the last thunder eggs there, and last collectibles, and last ovals. Yada yada yada. Okay, so... The time has finally come for us to test out Julius's talisman machine. To get our first talisman. Jolly good, Ty. You've collected enough thunder eggs to power the machine. L let's give it a go, shall we? Outstanding! Simply outstanding! The energy levels are off the scale, and, and, and... Yes, yes, I've got a lock on one of the talismans! Stand back, Ty! It's coming through! Alright, here we go. Yeah, there it is! The first talisman! But we're not just gonna get it real like that. We gotta face a boss first. Bull's Pen. The giant razorback with a tattoo and an eye patch. And a shirt that would make a... That would make a bar patron jealous. <laughs> oh! Oh, yes! Make him scream in agony by making him run into the termite mounds and... And... and, and, and. <laughs> yep. Oh. So, yeah. And bull, but he's a Razorback! I keep getting it. Wow. He's gonna... <laughs> You can laugh too. And it's got a rocking theme too. I might have. Whoa! Ew. Halitosis breath belts. <laughs> so yeah. Oh no, not again! Toro! Toro! Okay, so yeah, basically just inside of wild razorback pig's pen. Come on, big guy. Oh yeah, you can't... You gotta lure him into the termite mounds at the last moment. Oh man, this is just... Yeah, he's really got the attire that would make a... a dockside bar patron jealous! Oh! And he's also got a mouthful of mucus. That is so super gross. Ow! Oh! And he can also make shack waves. That's... unexpected. Charging into those termites' mounds and they give him hell. They ain't too happy about a wild razorback ruining their home, now are they? Okay, big guy. Oh, and he can chuck boulders. Okay, that's. Big guy. Yeah, yes. 
Yeah, somebody clean that pig's mouth. Yeesh. That is disgusting. Talisman, baby. I put it in its place. Well done, Ty. You've retrieved the first of the ancient talismans. When Boss Cass discovers that we are out to thwart his plans, he will do all in his power to stop you. Be careful, my friend. She'll be right, old timer. Shock me, lucky you actually found the talisman. I just might have bet on the wrong horse. Anyway, mate, Julius has got a present for you at his lab. Oh, does he now? Well, let's go take a look see then. Alright, so I'm gonna get introduced to the place where you can get new boomerangs. I've made <laughs> a most exciting discovery. The talisman machine is brimming with excess energy from the Fire Thunder eggs. By diverting that energy to my special Hyper Techno Boomerang Maker, I can make special elemental rangs. Watch. Simply smashing, I present to you the Flamerang. You beauty! Yes, yes, this ring can start fires and melt ice. It even has a more powerful effect on some enemies. To select it, use the previous rang and next rang buttons to cycle through your collection. It will aid you well in your quest. Now, do try it out. Alrighty, the flamerangs. You beauty. Okay, so, let's see what the description for that type of ring has. Alright, love the charge, love the pyro lava look of it. Looks super badass. Okay, the Flamerang. Harnessing the power of the fire thunder eggs, the Flamerang creates a devastating fireball and impact. Lightweight and durable. Not only is it lethal to enemies, it can also melt ice. Well, no duh. And... Wow. Ty just looks super cool with just those... Just like, uh, holding torches. Okay, well, we can just... Switch between Boomerang and Flamerang. But that's not all. We've got more than enough Golden Cogs for more Rangs. So, just wa watch what happens. Oh my! You found enough golden cogs, haven't you? These will be perfect for my latest invention. I call it the Cogulacious Boomerangerous Extrapolator. Ty, it's a machine I designed to create cutting edge techno rangs. Oh my! This is very nice. It's a Zoomerang. The Zoomerang has a built-in telescopic aimer. Press the TIE's view button to activate it. Use the movement stick to aim and the camera stick to zoom in and out on enemies for greater throwing accuracy. No worries. To select it, use the previous rang and next rang buttons to cycle through your collection. Alrighty, zoomerang time. Okay, so just in the view and press up on the C stick. Zoom in, zoom out, zoom in, zoom out. And just give it a quick toss. 
It goes really far. Alright, so... So yeah, basically it has a much farther reach than your average ring. Okay, next one, please. Hello again, Ty. Ah, I see you found some more golden cogs smashing. Smashing? Ty, let's try them out in the Rang machine. Eureka! We've created a multi-rang. According to my calculations, the multi-rang will allow you to throw a lot of rangs at the same time. Phew, beauty! Alrighty. So, yeah, the multi-rang just... Well, just... just watch. <laughs> just spamming boomerangs left and right. Spam, 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 wonderful spam. Okay, so. So, let's look, take a look-see at the descriptions. Okay, Zoomerang. With a built-in telescopic aimer, the Zoomerang has the longest reach of all the rangs. You can use it to zoom in on faraway objects. And the multi-rang. I also love the design of this one. N not as far, fast or far-reaching as the others, the multi-rang lets you throw multiple rangs at the same time. Use it to unleash a frenzy of boomerang justice on Cass's henchmen. <laughs> Alrighty, so... Let's grab an extra life. And that right there is a rainbow scale. We'll leave it for there for now. I'll... I'll devote an entire part to collecting all 25 of them at a later date, but I think for right now we can just mosey on back to to the Bly Bly station and re-enter the levels and try to recapture those invisible crates. Those, uh, we don't have the infrarang yet, and we're gonna need 50, at least 15 more golden cocks to make it to get that boomerang. But I think I have a checklist that can help us get the remaining invisible crates. So let us start our search in two up, and then we'll move on to walk in the park and shipwrecks. And it's tedious, and I doubt that many of you guys will wants to see me just go after boring concept arts, but uh, I'll skip to the good parts, just to show you where they are. Okay, so we're back at 2-Up, and uh, all the opals have been reset. Oh, goody. Okay, so... The first crate should be right at the starting point. Now, I know it's right around here somewhere. There it is. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, so there's seven and two up, so let's go for the next one. And we'll just ignore the thunder egg. Okay, next one. Up there. Lucky number three is right there. It's kind of in this little ledge with the fence. Alright. So, the next one should be in the trees up there, I do believe. Alright. I could just barely make it out amidst the branches, but that's, that's the next one. There's one. Okay, there should be only two left. Oh, while we're here, may as well use the... Use the plenty of power-up. Alright, here we are, bitches. you. Okay. 
should be one in the trees here somewhere, I think. Oop. There's one. Okay, one last one to find. Aha! There you go. Alright, so... That should be... Yes! Okay, so that's... So we already collected six before coming here, so... That should be all seven of them for two up. So... Can... Go back to Rainbow Cliffs now. Alright, so... I do think that one of them was down here somewhere. Aha! Here's one. Oh. Alright, so the next one's sort of in the area with the turkey, so... It's kind of out of the way, but... Oh! Excuse me. Okay, so I do think it's... I don't it's somewhere kind of out of the way here. It's gonna be, uh... It's close by the bowler ramps. At, aha! There it is. Well, uh... Yeah, it's sort of hard to make out. There it is. There we go. Alright, so at that huge waterfall right here, somewhere up there, just kind of behind the waterfall. Alright, so I think it's right there, alright. Okay, so that should be all of them for Walk in the Park. Just double check. Yep, that's all of them. Alrighty. Alright, the Great Barrier Reef once again, and ties all, all dressed up in proper swim attire. Okay, so there was another box at the other end of the beach house that's right here. Just a little bit high off the ground, so. Okay, five left. Alright. Okay, so... Well, one good thing about being back at Shipwrecks is we can try out the... Ooh! Of... Here's something cool. Yeah, you can set those huts on fire and you can reveal a friggin' basket. You can even just set those baskets on fire as well and just let them burn, I guess. Okay, so what do we... Yeah, we got the one above the, the shack, so... Whoa! Oh yeah, and you'll get swallowed by those big fish if you wander too close. Yeah, let's spit you back out again. Alright. Let's take a look back at the shipwreck area. Aha! Here's one. Okay, finally. Alright. Okay, so the next one should be right at the edge here. That's the ticket. Okay. I do think there was one back here. I know that we got one back here once, but there was another one. Aha! Right at the edge here. <laughs> Love using the flame rings on those. Okay, so we should have two left.
Okay, so Zoomerang. Let's try this. Alright, you beauty. Okay, so... Should be one at the Summit of Danger Spike. I think around the back. There it is. Alright. Just a chance to use our new boomerangs at the summit. Alright, beautiful. Without any bumping into objects, they glide beautifully back into your hands. Oh, there was an extra life there. Ooh, nice design on those beach towels, I might add. Okay, so the last one should be on one of these islands. If only I knew where. I think it's on this one. Should be on this one. Ah, there you are. There's the last one. Okay, that'll do it. Okay, so that's all 22 for the first set of areas. Alright, we can go back to Rainbow Cliffs. Okay, so yeah. So that was basically just a synopsis of where they're all located in the first few areas, for those of you who are just curious. Okay, so yeah, getting the Inferang makes it so much easier. But even still, it's still a headache just to find them all. Alright, well, we got ourselves a uh, fine new boomerangs added to our collection. But... We will get our chance to try them out as we head towards the next area, and then, but I think we've spent enough time in this section, I think we'll save it for the next part. So thank you guys for watching, please subscribe, and if you would leave a comment and or a like, that would be most appreciated. Until next time on Tie the Tasmanian Tiger, this is ToonGamer23, signing out. And <laughs> he's just massaging his... Was he just scratching his back with burning boomerangs? Basically, just... Ah, oh, he's doing it again! <laughs> you gotta scorch your fur, man! Don't do that. Eh, I think he can take the heat.